we are doing something a little bit different. We brought home our big unit, or part of our big unit, and we're starting to go through it because we have realized that there is quite a bit of food mixed in the uh, good stuff. So we're removing the perishables that are perished, throwing them away, and sorting out all of the good, usable, sellable stuff. We're just gonna keep you going with us while we're doing that yep. and let you see what we see. Yeah, I see a lot of Kleenex. A lot of napkins. Right here. Let me keep those. Yeah. Um, these look like little mini like shot glasses or oh my gosh. whatever More you call sleeves. these. Little bathroom cups. Yeah. This one though, looks like we're gonna be keeping the whole thing. Oh. Yep. We've got um, mini china plates plastic glasses, more napkins, more bathroom cups. So that one looks like I could put the lid back on and put it back Hand on. wipes, napkins, and cups. Yep. Okay. This is all like paper goods. All right. Well, that's good. Put the lid back on this one. Now this type stuff, we will keep some of it and use for ourselves, and some of it we'll, we'll actually probably try to sell locally. Like I'll put together a big package of napkins and paper towels and things and put it up on the marketplace. Oh, Believe it or not, that stuff sells. Look at the tubs that we got right inside. Yeah, here. these are all, all these tubs came out of that unit. All right, this one does got some stuff. This one does up. have food. This one looks like all food. I mean, this is, most of this stuff went out of date. It looks like nine, 10 years ago, 2011. So unfortunately we can't do anything with this, which kind of makes me sad in a way, because if we and had- we don't want to bring it into our yes, unit. Yes, but we don't want to bring it into our unit and have to deal with that. October. Um, 2000 yep, 11. Oh, I like stir fry. It was shrimp fry. I like shrimp fry. Okay. Sugar. A whole bag of sugar. Yeah, that would bring. Oh my gosh. Look at. <laughs> oh my gosh, marshmallows. They smell good. <laughs> Oh, they smell good. But oh my God, they are. I don't know. Does um, flavored extracts do those have to go out of date? I don't see any dates on those. I will do a little looking into that. So I don't see any dates on those. Oh, I found um, beans. Yeah, great northern beans. I know that beans might not go out of date. Well, I think they eventually do. They just have a long date. These went out of date in 2012. And that was a. We did get some chopsticks. Yay! <laughs> they might go to Amazon. They might, absolutely. Or lot them together and sell them on eBay. All right. The garbage man is gonna hate us. <laughs> this is some more good usable stuff. Plastic bags. We need another tub of keeping. Another tub for keeping? Yeah. Here, use this one. Once again, we will keep some of this that we can use for ourselves. What we can't, I'm going to lot up and put up on the marketplace. Yeah. Freezer bag. You guys need any freezer bags? We got three rolls right there. You know what? I think what we need to do, and uh -huh. you're going to hate this, Okay. but we need to have a yard sale. We could have a yard sale. This would actually make great yard sale stuff. This is great yard sale. Two knife sets. Those will probably go straight into Amazon. Uh, Amazon. Oh my gosh, these sell great Amazon. on Amazon. And we're gonna Amazon these too. Right here. Amazon. All of that we are not Amazoning the eight years out of date macaroni and cheese. <gasps> now, macaroni and cheese, I love it. Febreze to go, these will get used. I use the heck out of some here. Febreze. So we don't have to go through it again. Got two brand new irons. Those will probably go to Amazon as well. Yeah. And when I say brand new, this stuff is brand new. Just yeah. completely new. Yeah, this isn't stuff that we think is new. It's new. We've seen the receipts for it. Yes. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh god. Monster cables. Yeah, that's a HDMI. Those are brand new. Yep, it's HDMI. And they're not going to be $24 anymore. No. Probably about 10 a piece. But it's stuff that'll be super easy to sell. Same with these little phones. This phones, earbuds, earbuds, <laughs> a DVD lens cleaner, SD card readers. 
Which, this is why we are willing to dig through eight-year-old rice. <laughs> yep. Uh, that's a congratulations thing. That should be congratulating us for buying such a great game. <laughs> Ooh, that's a heavy one. Oh, yeah, food. Oh, what do we got in here? Well, that's cord. What's the gross thing? These are dead bugs that mm. aren't dead. Oh. Yeah, those are bugs. Oh, God, okay. This All one. Right, I'm gonna put this one off to the side. We're going to. Yeah. All right. Fun, fun. I'll put my gloves on for that one. I got a couple more in here, but. All right. Uh, just to let you know, Ebony Magazine back issues do sell. This is also. This is all food. Every bit of this needs to get tossed. Except there might be one bag down there that's not. What the hell? Okay, we got a ghost in the warehouse. Okay, we do have some health and beauty stuff here. Seems pretty good. A calculator? I don't know. This is all food and gross. Oh my gosh. What? This is what this one is. Oh. These little vinaigrette things. Okay. I didn't expect that. Let me go put this over here. I'm sure we can sell those somewhere. This is... Oh, is it stuck on the bottom? Yeah. That's a good idea. Periodically, we let off a bug bomb in our unit too. But we're trying our best not to bring in anything gross. This TV is in box, but it is new. But the other TV was brand new. This one's still going to be about $50. As long as you don't break it, yes. All right, we have a much cleaner looking tub here. Looks like someone went shopping at Kato Fashions. It is all new clothing, just various pieces of clothing. Shirts, pants, shoes. The hair accessories. Jewelry, all new. all new. Even the part, the purse here, brand new. That's exactly what this entire tub is: is brand new Kato fashion stuff. This tub doesn't really need any serious processing. It's just something we'll take home one day and decide how we're best gonna sell that. While Brian is working on that TV, I guess I will brave another tub. Okay, now well, we got a five piece whiskey set. Hopefully can sell that on Amazon. Then we do have a lot of food. This food does seem to be better packaged. It's not just bags of flour, so it does not have bugs in it, but it is still out of date and needs to be tossed. Potted meat, which I imagine has a long date on it, but probably not long enough to still be any good. No, it went out of date eight years ago. More food, bumblebee crab meat, out of date eight years ago. Canned soups. And this looks like it's gonna be like salad dressing or something. Yep, salad dressing, same thing, out of date. This is 
the non-glamorous part of going through storage units. <laughs> All right, this one is a mixture thing. We do have food. Which sadly, of course, is still all out of date, but we do have... It's definitely an older TV. Okay. So, um, I was just hooking it up and got all of the, the bells and whistles. Uh, oh my goodness. There is some sort of electronic gadget in the bottom of this box. Oh, really? Yep. Right. Unfortunately, one of the bottles of salad dressing seems to have spilled on it, so it will not be able to be sold brand new, but... Oh yeah, it's it's a wall mount. It's not electronic. Oh okay. It might come out of the box. The, uh, Marketplace, yeah. yeah, because this tub is gross. Uh -oh. What? I think that uh, that one coronet one, the one that's the twenty-four piece. Okay. Throw that one out. Yeah, I see what you're talking about. That's kind of gross. Yeah. All right, that needs to be cleaned. Yeah. All right. Uh, I'm going to take this. I'll, I'll go clean this. All right. Yep. Get it up today. Next tub. This one looks a little bit safer. We've got health and beauty. We've got paper goods. There might be some solid dressing in the bottom, unfortunately. But just more odds and ends and usable stuff. Sellable stuff. Um, that, that is more salad dressing. It's getting tossed. Um, okay, what do you think? Non-stick spray out of date. Yeah. Yeah, that looks good. Yep. I'll sell it as like new rather than new, which is what I do with anything like that that doesn't look like it came straight off the shelf. Coffee filters. Um bunch of blank invitation cards. Those will probably actually sell on Amazon. Oh my gosh. A disc cleaning kit. Some baby cologne, which I didn't even know was a thing. Just various odds and ends and as I said yesterday I have no idea why this stuff existed why this stuff was stored in a unit if this person thought they were prepping for you know a possible apocalypse or something or they were a uh, the guy, I talked to the guy and he told me that she lived in Colorado the owner of the unit the owner of the unit is actually in Colorado too hmm. so we don't know exactly how Stuff ended up here right that's where it all is but anyway i think we're gonna go ahead and wrap this video up for now it's been about 15 minutes and i don't want to okay well i'll do one more box then while brian's trying to get the tv going see if our used tv is going to be a success I got a brand new dirt double and then a bunch of food. <laughs> and I apologize for not offering anyone any fruit newtons, but trust me, you don't want these. You don't want eight year old out of date Vienna sausages or Ingle brand milk either. But it makes me sad to throw all this away because I do like 
being able to give things to the less fortunate, the food pantry and things. And I just think to myself, if we could have just got this eight years ago, somebody would have enjoyed eating this stuff. But unfortunately, it doesn't always work out that way. This is far from the grossest food we've ever found in a unit, though. Um, that is a tie between a roast beef sandwich that was completely made, a deli roast beef sandwich that I've picked up and got to feel what a multi-year-old roast beef sandwich feels like, which is really gross. Crazy lady unit. And a roll of ground beef. You know those rolls of ground beef from the grocery store? It was just packed into a tub with a bunch of kitchen stuff. And I didn't actually have to touch that one, but I did smell it. And that is a scent that will linger in my nose for years to come. Brian is still struggling with the TV here. So I guess I will continue. It's a very light box. What do we got here? Oh, we've got a brand new deep fat fryer. Somebody said something about an air fryer, I think. I think Robin wants an air fryer or somebody. I don't remember who now. Uh, notebook cooling fan, brand new. That was a good box because there was nothing gross in it. No old crackers. Oh, TV's working. Are we allowed to show like uh, DVD things? I know we're not allowed to play music. Um, I mean, I think a very short clip of one just to show that it's working. Just don't sit there and show the whole movie and try to give everybody a free peek <laughs> at Shrek 2 or whatever we have over here. Oh my God. Night <sighs> Double check this puppy out. Oh, I got it's a nice DVD player too. That's a Sony. Um, Might be a couple bucks on eBay. Yeah. Or in the booth. It depends on booth. If, I can, if I can get it to working great and all of that Right. Stuff. You know. Let's see. That would be a dang brain surgeon to really get this stuff in here. Well, you know how old it is. You can always tell how old something is by this, but it does have HDMI. Okay. So we can use that for sure. loading dvd player is loading yep there you it's go. playing All yes right. so i'm gonna put this up on the marketplace um i'm gonna put just that up right there for 60 dollars. i think i think i can get 60 dollars. i this. think it's so 40 inch yep and got the remote works great we should actually probably go ahead and take a picture now while it's up on the screen the let me see if the remote is really working oh my gosh the remote well, I didn't think it. Oh. oh, you can even hear it. Yep. All right. Well, I'm going to go ahead and wind this video down. Yes. Uh, but what we're going to do is we're going to continue to go through those boxes and find get rid of food. food. We want to get rid of the food. I don't want to bring any more food in here. We've already had one issue with rats. And, you know, maybe we'll watch Night at the Museum while we're working right over there. <laughs> and there are TV that's right over here. Plus, I got a brand new TV over there. Two. Um, microwaves over there brand new microwaves in the, that were in the unit We've and just got those tons of for $4 weird dollars weird stuff yeah but okay. anyhow we're gonna end the video for now yeah and please remember to like share and subscribe we'll see you next time bye bye, -bye.